All right, what's going on, everybody? Uh, sorry I've been absent from the YouTube world, but uh, I've been out of town in Georgia. Um, I'm going to show a clip. I just figured maybe y'all like it, but uh, it's actually an alligator refuge, and it's free to go in if you're ever over by Savannah, Georgia area. It's uh, right down the South Carolina, Georgia state line, and it's free, actually. Um, you can hike ride bikes, drive a car. It's like a little over four miles long and uh, they're not caged in so you can drive down the road they can be actually laying in the road. You, uh, I mean there's nothing from them getting to you and you being able to get towards them kind of ordeal if that makes sense. Um, it was real windy sorry about the crappy footage uh, but I tried my best with what I had being on the road and stuff. Uh, I just now found my other uh, bracket for piece for my good GoPro, my new one. So now I can start going back to using that. But uh, yeah, now I can get back to making some more footage that we're that now we're back and stuff. And uh, like I said, I hope y'all enjoy it. If y'all are new to the channel, I'm Robert, and welcome to VA Adventures. And uh, hope y'all enjoy the content. And uh, catch y'all later. I don't know how well y'all can see that, but we're at the Savannah National Wildlife Refuge. And I used to go to this place with one of your kids. And there's alligators and stuff here, but they're not fenced in. You can walk, jog, whatever, hike. Or you can ride your car around, and it's actually free. So, I'll give you a tour of it and see how y'all like it. And we got some uh, leftover crystals for lunch. So, maybe we can feed more. You know, so. Uh, there's one literally right there. It looks like a log. Airport chop. That could be dinner right there. Look, right there's a little tiny, tiny gator. Little baby thing. See it, Linda? Minutes. He's got plenty of food to snack on. Yeah, look at that. And here at this place, you can literally, like we are, we just park right there, but you can literally just walk around freely. There ain't nothing that keeps you from them and them from you or anything. But it's pretty neat and it's free. So you, anybody can come out and check it out. We're uh, visiting my brother right there from Georgia. So I've been here since I was in middle school. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I really want to feed him something. Nice. I'm sorry, Dad. Huh? He might like it. Look, look. Say hey. Can you say hi? See what else we can find. Check out how crazy that moss looks. It's neat. All through here. Hanging down. Looks pretty wicked. Alright. We're about halfway through the thing because it's four miles long. But there's one right there, sitting across, right there by the mud. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. There's some shadows in here, and they look big. You see the wrinkles because they put off. They kind of make these little vibrations sometimes, and it looks like there's a couple of them in here, like right over there. y'all can see it easier now but it looks like a log but definitely a nice little that's one about four foot there four or five foot one 
right above, right below the water, right where all the bubbles were. Yeah. They were probably vibrating. Because I know they're amazing. Yep. Look, he got closer. He's literally right there. Hey, big too. The big boy. Oh, he's moving closer. Look, he's steadily moving with just a hair. Like. Every time as we were standing here, we've only been here for a couple minutes, he started way over there. And he's marked his way around and he keeps going under. And you can tell when he is because you see bubbles. They make see oh, now watch. Yeah. He's going under. Now watch. He's gonna come up close. And he's gonna make bubbles. He see? Vibrating. You can see the uh, bubbles starting to be made on the surface. Hopefully you can see them. Now he's heading right towards the center right here. You can see all the minnows moving and the bubbles and everything. He's gonna pop up right in front of us. Right in front of us this time, look. Yep, he's right there. See, he's gonna come right up to by the shoreline right here. He thinks he's sneaking up on you. There he is. You can see a part of them right there. But here he comes. He's coming closer and closer. Yeah, he's coming close. He's getting real slow moving. And he's not coming up as quickly as he was. But look, he's right here by the lip. Right here. Not even five foot off the shoreline is where he's sitting at right this second. There he is. See? He just popped up right there. He's moving closer and closer to us. Look at him right there. He wants, as we're getting in the car, now he wants to show himself more. Leaving from over there, he actually came over here. Check it out. Now you can see him better. Pretty neat. He's a big one. He's a big one. Look at that big sucker. Boy, it fit just right on the grill. something to share with everybody if you're ever down this area to check out it's a pretty nice little uh, thing to come see especially you got kids and stuff that want to see them I like my six month old that don't have a clue what's going on yet <laughs> <laughs> 